The men gather around you, and you accept that there was probably too many for you to successfully fight off anyway. You allow them to take your dagger, and they haul you roughly to your feet. Someone produces a rope and binds your hands behind your back. The Count, satisfied the situation has been de-escalated, for now, sheathes his sword. He looks towards you, then towards Richard, and says, I realize tensions are high. And Richard, I sympathize. You know I also lost my cousin in the battle. With that last, he turns to you and gives you a resentful look. You can't help but wonder for a moment if you killed your own lord. But something in his eye says you are not directly responsible. But we cannot allow our grief to rule us. It is towards Crixor that our ire should be dispensed. The Count continued. Richard lets out a yell of pent-up rage, frustration, and pain. As one of the men administering to him places a hot metal skewer over his wound to cauterize it, you wince inwardly as you realize that you let your emotions get the better of you, hurting the man more than you maybe would have liked. Before Richard could muster the strength to speak, Jerome steps forward. Lord, I have examined the vial and the journal. It seems as though Aldric has indeed found a clue to this mystery. The vial contains a concoction that, if imbibed, renders the subject in a zombie-like state, open to mental domination from the creator's mind. It is as I feared, then, says the Count. Do you apologize for what you have done? Ask if your memory can be recovered, or stay silent for now. Hey guys, Nathan here. I'm having a lot of fun writing this story with you all, and if you enjoy it as well, it would super help me if you guys could drop a like so that other people who may also enjoy it can get to see it. And also, feel free to jump on the website and cast your vote as well. I know a lot of people that are doing it so far are having a lot of fun because they get to go in and vote and choose what Aldrich's going to be doing next. And I also really enjoy it because then you may take the story in a direction that I didn't expect or I didn't think of. I am creating this live as you guys vote, so there's nothing pre-planned. It's all kind of just coming out of my brain as you guys vote, which is super fun for me. It lets me be super creative with your guys' choices. It's much more fun when someone else helps me influence the story. Thank you for all the support so far, and I hope you guys have a great day.